Hiya kittens! Welcome back to Life is Strange, Episode 4, Faith. We last left off where Daniel ditched everybody. Daniel exploded. Daniel doesn't know how to use his powers in an adequate mind space. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They lived in peace until hunters took their dad away. And they had to go on the run. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick, and they had to move on. The brothers made it to the home of their ancestors, and the old wolves took care of them. Unfortunately, the hunters were hot on their trail and found them. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south. They soon entered the old forest of the giants, where they met a pack of stray dogs who worked in a secret farm. The brothers joined them and worked hard to stock up on gold for the future. They were happy to find others like them, and everybody loved the little wolf, who was growing up fast. His power was growing, too. The little wolf was more and more confident and independent. The big brother loved having a new pack to prowl around with. He felt free for the first time. Suddenly, the mean farmers who owned the land tried to hurt the brothers. The leader of the pack was killed. The little cub turned into a super wolf and destroyed everything. The big brother was badly wounded. And worse, he didn't know where the little cub was. So Daniel's missing. We're looking for Daniel. Everything's all F to the A. another beautiful wooded area. Do we get to start with Daniel or are we starting him with Sean? Freddy's. I wonder if there's like um, music attached to this scenario. <laughs> I keep replaying afterwards with music or with the copyrighted music on just so I can hear the soundtrack because the soundtrack to these games is very good. I still listen to Life is Strange 1 soundtrack. Hey. Hey, Sean. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. It was a bad idea. Daniel. No way. It's all good. I'm confused. I wish we didn't go along with Finn, even though I wanted to. It's okay, dude. You're my brother, and that's all that counts. So, why don't you come get me? I thought Daniel I ran off. I don't know what to do. I'm scared. Don't get so close to that edge. Please, come and get me. Yes, I, I swear. <gasps> Stop! Okay, I was supposed to say, like, what the heck is going on? Like, why is, <laughs> why is Daniel about to jump off a cliff? Why is Daniel even in the picture, for that matter? 
Nope, we're just, you know, having nightmares. A hospital in Northern California, two months after the blast at Merrill's. Comatose? Was he in a coma, or did we just randomly skip two Fuck. months? This must be my punishment. Mm, yummy porridge. Ugh, can't even focus on the page. This sucks ass, man. I can't... Oh, I was supposed to say I can't read that. Was in a coma for weeks, blind and fucked, and in police custody, going to jail soon. Hospitals freak me out. Me too, bro. Me too. Hate this. Where's Daniel? I'm scared. Let's keep reading his journal. Tried to draw the kill times. This room is a cage, but I suck now. No depth perception. No art. No shit. Focusing equals immediate migraine. Going crazy here. Woke up crying. Oh, Sean. You can get it back. Special secret agent Flores. She's trying to bond with me, trap me, or trust me. So, effed. Cops still can't find Daniel after the explosion. So, so he's out there alone. Honestly, he's probably doing good. He's probably stealing with his magical powers because we taught him to steal. Happy birthday, Daniel, wherever you are, Inano. Clarence Stevens sent me a letter... Clarence Stevens sent me a nice letter. So lonely. I read it twice. Weird how I missed them. So cool to hear from Captain Spirit, too. Glad he's doing okay. Oh my god! Is it taking my original choices, or did it just randomly lock out that... Because in my... With Captain Spirit, he gets hurt. If you haven't seen that, spoiler, go watch the previous episodes. Oh, I could draw. Let's draw. Let's hope this works. It didn't work at all the first day this game launched. I wasn't the I only just need one. To focus on the subject and get in the zone. What are we focusing like I used on? To. I guess we're focusing on the windows. Yay! Do 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 do. Oh no! So hard to focus. It's okay, Sean. We're gonna focus Gotta again. Way more. Oh, you are not giving up. So mad at Daniel. I guess that's an okay start. It's an okay start. But Stop. I can keep going. Stop being hard on yourself. Look at that. That's so good. I feel like we're back in the day with you drawing and shiitakes. Draw prison bars or a staircase. I don't want him to feel like he's in prison. Let's draw a staircase. Oh. The cops and doctors won't tell me anything about what's going on with you except that you were seriously injured and in official police custody. They interviewed me slash interrogated me, Hannah and Penny, and let us go. You weren't so lucky, I guess, or maybe you earned it. My heart is still broken over Finn's death. Finn's dead? Did that happen? Did I get Finn? I don't think I got Finn shot in my playthrough. And we all can't believe somebody with so much life isn't here anymore. I have dreams about him all the time. Yep, he was the fluff. Yep, he was a fluffed up, but he was our fluffed up, and our family. With Finn gone, our real family is roadkill. Now we're just a lonely trail. Train hopping all over, but it feels like we're in a loop to nowhere. Hannah and Penny aren't the same, and we fight too much. I'm not even sure we'll be together for much longer. Shiitake changes, right? But no way I'm going back to Hillsboro. No, you're going to trial soon over the Seattle situation. And I hope you get some form of justice. I hope you and Daniel find your way home soon. I'm not sure I will any time, Cassidy. Okay. TV! Yay! <laughs> Stupid reality shows. <laughs> you had the exact gusto I did. Oh, hey, let, let's just... Let's get a nurse in here, because I'm bored. What is there to do in a hospital? Nurse! Nurse! Oh, nurse! Can I draw more? Oh. Oh. 
We could finish it. I didn't think I had to do that. Okay, let's do this now. We draw some stairs, Sean. Woo! Yay, now it's finished and I'm so happy. Wish I could find a highway to freedom. Oh, Sean. Yo! Hi! <laughs> Good day, sunshine! Well, Can aren't you, you a happy you go lucky nurse? Hey, man. That looks like it might have been food. Hard to tell. Ha ha. Never heard that before. Oh. Somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm. I don't blame you. But maybe I got something to cheer you up. Pecans and chocolate? Uh-oh. There's that smile. Thanks, Joey. So how you feeling today? Any headaches? Socket pain? No. It's all good. Well, this is your final test before... Mm, you know. Before they... Check you out. Check me out to Juvie. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's see. You know the drill. Don't blink and just stare at the light. Yes. Nice retina response. Okay. Now, try to follow the light as well as you can. Do I have to follow the light? Good, good. Keep going. Quick response. Nice. Sean, you got this. Remember, this is weird. To see objects on your left side, you gotta turn your head more now. Yes. Looking good, Sean. Now try to align your pen with mine. I'll try. No rush. This is tough. Your depth perception will always be affected. So you gotta try harder. Oh, shit. Oh, this is a little hard. Yeah, I know. Whoa. It's hard. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's enough. Too much stress on you and your eye. But remember, your depth perception will always be affected. Hmm. Here, read this. Rhyme to never lose an eye. Patient clear. Patient clear. Send him right to jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. I always hated that game. You can try. But you can't rig the exam, Sean. Hmm. This time we release you. Sorry. Your vision has improved a lot. Now you don't really have severe side effects anymore. Yeah. That's just great. I do have to tell them the truth. But first, let's clean this dress. Hey. Sure hope you're watching the door like your phone. Oh, come on. <sighs> we ain't going nowhere. Great. All I do is watch her. Yes, true. Your job. Oh, goody. Do you mind if we talk alone? Mind if I finish with my patient? He looks good for now, right? Just come back when I finish with him. Oh, police, if a person's in the sure. hospital, just let them heal up before you go and go, hey, 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 50,000 questions. Not later, Sean. Stay cool. Oh, super cop lady. So, how are you feeling today, Mr. Diaz? Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. What? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? Until it makes sense. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. What does that mean, until you get it, it right? Close, Sean. 
Tomorrow you're going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arraigned in court for the murder of a Seattle police officer. You might spend the rest of your life in prison or you can talk to me. I didn't kill anyone. I didn't kill anyone. The end. So, who did? You do know. It's just, I can't. Was Daniel involved? Is that why you can't talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer? My dad was dead beforehand. Yeah, he came outside. Then he was killed. That's what he did. Just guilty of being... Who knows? I hear you, but... You sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It happens. Jesus, no! Look at me. Okay, let's just jump ahead. Tell me what happened in that farm in Humboldt. We have a young homicide victim, shot to death. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. I've told you so many times. I have no clue why the place was trashed. I passed out. We have another injured victim, older male, the owner, and a missing child. The only statement we have is yours. Sean, throw me a bone here. Can't you see I want to help? So you haven't found my brother? We might have some leads. You can help by telling me the truth. <sighs> okay. Fuck. The robbery. Whose idea was it? His? Or yours? Huh? It was definitely Finn. Finn. It was his idea to rip off Mero. Did he force you to help? Or did you go along with it? No, he forced Daniel. He lied to us. Made it seem like no big deal. I swear. Swear. I didn't think anything like this was gonna happen. Nobody does, Sean. Until it's too late. Yeah. Now I know. Your friend had to learn the hard way. With his life. Oh, I didn't want this. I didn't want any of this shit. Now I gotta live with it. You're not alone, Sean. There are people that want to help. By the way, we contacted your grandparents in Oh, Greece. God. They can visit you after you're transferred. Might be a while, but you do have a support group. That's good. I guess your grandpa can walk now after his surgery. We couldn't track down your mother, though. Sorry. Good. Like I would want to see Daniel? her? You said you had leads. I said might. Uh, hold on. I gotta take this call. I know how to find Daniel with things that Uh-huh. Everything okay? Everything's okay. Sorry about that. No idea what she said. I don't speak Spanish. Or I don't speak well enough in Spanish. So what's going on with Daniel? You really have leads? Yes, we do. That's our job. The Bureau put his profile out over four states. So we are on the case. That's not... 
That's not Leeds going, hey, we put a you fucking APB you on no him. Leads. You have no fucking idea where my brother is. I don't lie, Sean, but you did. And your brother is paying the price. Fuck. You. I'm done. Anyway. Thanks for talking to me. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to Jolina Shore. <laughs> His ears are all like glistening because of the shine texture on the graphics. Look out. I have to guard the guard now. <laughs> Love it. Sit down so we can get this show going. So, how did your interview with Scully go? Interrogation. You mean interrogation? Who knows? Maybe Detective Flores wants to help. Maybe not. I just can't trust her. After what you and your brother went through, I don't blame you. Aw, oh, this shit is all wrong, man. You've been out of the garden for three weeks now. We talk every day. I can see that you're a good person. <laughs> He's not, but okay. But I'm not. I've done too many mistakes. I let everybody down. I lost Daniel. And I'm going to juvie. This is all bullshit. Now let's check this out. The healing is coming along nice. Just gotta keep it clean for the next week or so. Simple. That's great. Seen the shrink this morning? What did she say? Nothing I wanna hear. This will take time and rehab, Sean. You have to process first. Ugh. I can tell myself that shit. <laughs> Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their anger into energy. You will too. <laughs> Plus, the glass eye tech is pretty cool now. <laughs> Things change, huh? Oh, well, great. So he has no left eye at all. Like, I thought it was just like. I you. I'm trying to be positive. That's right. Positive so mental hard. attitude. Thanks, Jack. I know. I do. But I promise there's a treat coming your way. Now, as for your wound, this is the last time you hear this from me. You have to clean it with sterile gauze and saline solution. Mm -hmm. uh. Well, that Hope ASMR. The area using the swab and cream. Mm. It's going to be all squishy sounds again. Oh, that was so... Then wrap it up with clean dressing. That was so horrible. You're the shit. Can't you guys Remember, give him, like, a black patch so he could be this. a pirate? More time arr, today. Arr, arr, arr. I won't forget. I'm sorry about everything, Sean. Wish I could have done more. Dude, you saved my ass here. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. I'm glad when I can make a ch... Oh shit! Emergency. I'm out. And no smoke break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. What he sneak? Catch you later. If I was ever in a hospital, I want nurses to sneak me things I'm not supposed to have. Joey, you are her boss. Wee, let's go to the towel. Check. What did we get? What's our snack? What? Wow. I haven't seen you in a long time. Oh. Let's grab Joey's Joey's pen. Look. Joey's the only one who helped me get through this shit. Okay. I just wanted to see Joey's pen first. Oh, I can actually pick it up. Let's pick it up. I 
Are we about to stab somebody? New souvenir collected. But I don't have a backpack. Okay, let's... How come... There we go. I'm like, how come I can't get back to the sketchbook? I know I fucked Daniel over. Again. And now he's gone. Where would he hide out? A ten-year-old by himself? He went to find your mom, that's- Out there? I'm sure of it. He might go back to Seattle. But too far. Nowhere to go. If he tried to hook up with Claire and Steven, they would have definitely told me. Or the cops. Wait. What's that? Breathe. I cannot read this, Henry. 2017. Had a few beers. Daniel's asleep. Same night, every night. He wants to train more, but we don't have time, and we gotta hide. It's not easy. Sean, I borrowed a blanket and a few other things from your tent. We'll give them back to you when you come looking for your Silver Wolf comic. It's waiting for you, Jake. Haven Point, Nevada. But the new workers from Europe, Anders and Ingrid, or Ingrid. Cute couple. Makes me want to travel overseas someday. Had a long talk with Jacob. He's like a little kid. He lived in some religious commune from Haven Point, Nevada. Looks fine here. Free. I gotta get to him. How would he be in Nevada? Find a way to escape. Nevada. Nevada. Tonight. That's all. Oh my god, this is not gonna go well at all. Sacred Hope Hospital. Oh hey, that sounds very familiar. Why does that sound familiar? Okay. Time to clear off now. This whole hospital is so quiet. How are you? So don't make any noise. How are we as find a way to get the hell out of here? Look under bed. Nada. Can I take blanket? Nope. I should close these. So nobody sees me sleepwalking away. Can I have some privacy, please? Okay, let's look at the evacuation plan. Like, I'm gonna let's remember see. this. I just gotta get past that locked door. And an angry guard. Ha 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 ha! Past a locked door and an angry guard. Oh my god. You are here. Okay, no. So, we, as soon as we leave our room, we make a right, and we go all the way down to the hallway, to the stairs, and we either go up those stairs or down those stairs, whichever direction the stairs are going. Because it looks like that's one of those weird one-way stairs. Wish I could just walk out. My backpack has got to be somewhere around here. Sweet dreams, my friend. Maybe I can trick him. Hey, let's sir? see if we can. Hello. Is this when you take a nap? Okay. Damn it, we could have just left. He take What's a nap. Head hurts. I need aspirin. That's a sad story, but I'm not a pharmacist here. I could <sighs> trick him into coming in here and then. Knock him out. Um, if 
find a way to escape the hospital. We know this. Wait, we can customize our bag? Wait, since when? I love customizing things. Just let me... Oh, I need... Um, I can't walk through that part of the curtain. That's hilarious. Is there anything in the bathroom? There must be a way to leave this room without alerting anyone. This one isn't screwed in. Yes. Let's do it. Okay, I didn't know what I was supposed to do there. Come on. Come on. We got this. We got this. Woo! We're so hey. strong. What the hell are you doing in there? I'm about to knock you out, boy. That's what I'm doing in here. Press I to toggle my inventory. I did press I. Right. How? What? What am I supposed to do now? Sean? Yeah. Don't want to. You know you'll never get that eye back. And now you touched it with your dirty hands. You're gonna have to. Cl we have to clean your wound again. I don't know. Do I get the call button? Ooh, bed sheets. Maybe. Maybe I could uh, rig a decoy Sean in the bed. Does that work? A decoy shot in the bed? <sighs> that looks so fake. That does. But it might work for a second. Hey, hello? I need help. Please. Oh, I could've done this. What's the matter, kid? Huh? My head. It's killing me. I need help. Hold on. Oh, you're gonna need help if you're fucking with me. Dude, we're assaulting a guard. That's at least six months. You're adding more to your sentence, Sean, and I'm the one who made him ch I chose to do this. Jeez. Louise. I'm sorry, Sean. We probably could have done the, like, sleeping body thing and just bolted and tried to escape. Physical therapy, chapel, intensive care unit. Are we escaping? Like, can I get out of this room? Oh. I never needed to look at the darn thing. Crawl. Fuck. Meryl. He must be in pretty bad shape if he's been kept here for so long. No. I'm not gonna cry for you, asshole. It's like, you're the reason why we're all in this. So I wonder, like, what's wrong with Meryl? Like, h how badly did it affect him? Are we- which car are we taking? Who's the dummy who left their door open? Is 
Is someone seeing this? Because there's a nice uncanny view of that window up there that keeps flashing at us. I swear, if he stole his favorite nurse's car, he's gonna be... He's gonna hate himself so much. Bye, Sacred Hope Hospital. Hope to never see you again. I bet your food is better than the hospital I've been to. It literally has this, like, odor to it that makes you so nauseous, you can't even eat. My theory is they purposely have that smell to keep you in the hospital longer because you're not eating, which means you can't get cleared to go home. Wait, so does this mean I get to, like, accessorize my backpack? I'm so happy! Daniel- Daniel. Sean? No, no. Sweet pea. Honey. Babe, you need to wake up. You need to stay awake. You do not drive yourself off the edge of the road. And you know what you need to do? Which is something not... Oh, I don't even want to explain this. Watching enough cop shows and court TV have taught me that as you steal a car, you change the plates every such and such miles. That way, they'll be looking for the car you're in, but they won't find the plates. And cops will just be like, oh, that's not the car. That's not the car. Come on, Sean. You got this. You so got this. I'm glad that they added a decent amount of um, non-copyright music to this because the first episode, if you take out the copyright music, where this definitely would have had a song that we could not play for YouTube without getting like a strike or a claim, has. And I love that there's like just like a mild tone to it so it's not like, oh I'm sitting here in the with nothing and I have to like sing to keep me at Awake. Come on, Sean. You being tired is making me yawn. Life is strange, too. Episode 4, Faith. And we're finally in the episode that's only the precursor. Because they have precursors now. Does anyone else see a face? Oh, you can't see my thing. But a face in the middle of the mountain? Yeah, it that same mountain. Like they didn't ta change the texture on it. Oh look, it's a fox. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. I want one as a pet. Welcome to Nevada, Nevada. I don't know how to pr properly pronounce it. I get yelled at no matter how I pronounce it. So that's always going to be fun. It's like how people pronounce organ like organ or organ or organ like organ as in organs. It's organ. On the road again. What are we doing? Oh, I have nothing to do yet. On the road again. We are drifting softly on the road again. I somehow found some smokes on the road again. A car just passed me on the road again. Hope you guys like my weird catchy songs <laughs> that I sing every now and then. On the road again. Is someone gonna see me on the road again? Oof. Sean, I hate to tell you this, but keeping the lights on the inside of the car can definitely kill your battery, and that's not something you need or want right now. Guess this is my room for the night. Ah, uh, fuel gauge. Shit. <laughs> yeah. I will never hold on to a haven point. Get some gas. We took Agent Flores' oh, card. Come on. 
Did you interview everyone in that hospital? Or what? Well, at least we have Agent Flores's card. Look. She seems nice. Yeah. Sorry I stole your car, guys. <laughs> Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. May May 8th. Must to do. Drop off kids. Hospital checkup. Lunch with the hobby. Miss Scott X blood test. Pick up kids. Night shift. But you ran away in the night? So unless this is for tomorrow, she's already done this. Oh, wait. There is a next page. She's oh, oh, shit. never mind. Guess I fucked up her day. But... There's nothing about the cigarettes. We're gonna take it. Seriously, if we ever need like something later on, that's gonna help us. Even though they just said. Okay. Even point is straight ahead. Jeez. Too bad you couldn't literally drive, like, straight ahead. Where are we? Are we here? Is this us? That's... That's a long way. What a mess. Plotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. Yeah, not the first time, love. I like how we're like on the road again and we're whoops 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 and we're gonna clean our eye because if I don't that gets infected and I might lose my other eye right. and then be blind blind Careful. blind hey at least with him there's no like <laughs> sounds that was horrible I have the volume up a little bit Man. in this game because I know it's soft. You should have listened to Joey. This is a mess. You, cause you didn't. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. Can we go to sleep now? Oh. Thank you. Because I'm like, that's killing the car's battery. We're never going to make it to Haven without gas and battery all at the same time. All right, get some sleep. Something tells me we're gonna be woken, be fluffed up. We're on the road again. We're driving to Haven to see Ingrid and her friend, and I forgot the friend's name, so we're on the road again. I only have one eye to see. I don't know how I should drive out of this century. Oh. You're with me, Sean? <laughs> yeah. Just. That's their out. car. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. Huh. So, uh, what's the verdict on the new car? That's device. I know it's not a new board, but it's got four hot wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. <laughs> I'm proud, Sean. Aww. That makes up for when you bullshit me about needing cash. And I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? Oh. I hope you're not too bummed out to go on a big road trip with your lovely papito, huh? <laughs> That's sad. This is, okay, before I even pick a, a thing, this is literally like, I know this is a dream, but he's dreaming about, like, present day conversations with his father. Oh, man, you're ther you need therapy, my love. <laughs> oh, please. You're the coolest dad. How could I be bummed? Excuse me. <laughs> Where's my regular emotionless son? <laughs> I left him back at I the hospital, it. and I'm now so can hang out for happy. Five days without killing each other. Nope. Oh yeah. No one can Haven't hang done out. That since I was a kid. Miss. 
In a car, no one can survive each other so for five days. I. You do need mental breaks. Even if you hate to get hugs from your old man. <laughs> I'm glad we're here. You know me, Dad. I keep everything in sight. Good to hear. <laughs> By the way, boy talk. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> um... I don't uh, remember. Is that the girl he had the crush on? Well, not much to talk about. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. Um, uh, don't worry. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Not much to say. Okay, okay. Keep your secrets to yourself. I won't pry. Ah, could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. <laughs> nah. He's an angel. We went to the swimming pool, and now we're making popcorn from movie <laughs> night. Yes. It's so cool. Hey, Sean. Don't crash the car. He's driving <sighs> real slow and safe. Like a grandma. Thanks for checking <laughs> in. Well, Buzzy went to the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean, Jen wants you to call her <laughs> when you have time. Oh, ho, ho. sounds like someone is still thinking about you. Yeah, I know. Seriously, how are you really doing? I miss home. I miss you. I've changed. I've changed because something tells me this breaks up the dream sequence. I'm so different now. I don't even recognize myself. Because you've changed. It's like evolution. I know it hurts. <laughs> Big time. Guess I wasn't ready to change. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and find your way home. God. I love you, Dad. No. Wish I would have told you more. You didn't have to tell me. You showed me. Boom. By the way. Oh. Hey, wake up. Huh? Huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh no. Oh man, I crashed hard. Oh yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm coming. Hold on. Good. Now we can see you. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. Need some rest. I drove for so long, I... I had to pull over to get some rest, you know? I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign? Didn't you see it? I... was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's just a kid, and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? <sighs> An accident? I... Got into an accident. Oh yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. <sighs> Please. I just want to go. Ho-ho. Oh, what's this? Drugs? Yeah. For my eye. Oh yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? I lost the keys. Well... I lost my keys. And my friend helped me start it. You mean you hotwired it? Holy cow, fucking car thief, too. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. Get it. Let's see what he's holding. So? Nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. 
You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. Uh-oh. Um, take it back, do nothing, take it back, do nothing, take it back, do nothing, take it back. Oh, no! No! I feel like take it back is gonna punch my other eye and I'm gonna lose my sight for everything. But Daniel's gonna be really upset. This would be the perfect thing to bring back to Daniel. So we're gonna take it back. Oh, oh my god. You did not. That's it, boy. Yep. Yeah. Sean, I make all the bad dis I make all the horrible decisions for you. I'm sorry. Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? Oh god. What? What what? Hablas español. Oof. Habla español. So, professor, how do you say I'm a dirty thief. Uh, let's no. Oh, you don't want to share your language? I didn't even get a chance. Okay, maybe you know this one. Uh, I'm a dirty thief with one eye. Yeah. <laughs> un ladrón y chinga tu madre. Uh, wait, madre. Uh... What did you really say, asshole? Huh? <laughs> All I want to do is learn Espanol. Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. Uh. How do you say, this is not my country? <sighs> Fuck off. <laughs> this is my country. We don't play games, boy. Ooh, look at that lightning. Oh, Chad, it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. No, we. I heard that area get some sick and wicked rainstorms, but basically lightning storms without the rain. me off, you know that. But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. Come on, Chad. Leave him alone. Sing something. What? What? Just pass the audition, and you're free. Oh, that's so beautiful. Be very upset if you refuse. I can't. What? I don't understand. Why do I have to sing something? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> Fine. Come on, Sean, continue. Chica, ¿dónde estás? Why are you singing in Spanish? Que serás en el cielo y en el mar. Oh my god, Sean, I'm sorry I broke you. I broke you and I'm sorry. Mike, let the boy finish his song. Go on. Go on. Estrellita, ¿dónde estás? Le pregunto que seas. Cuando el sol se ha ido ya. I should have refused and gotten punched again. Sean, I'm sorry. I'm a horrible person. I'm making you do horrible things, and your life is all messed up because of me. Brillas, brillas, sin parar. Estrellita, ¿dónde estás? Me pregunto, ¿qué serás? Well, damn! I think you just won Mexican Idol. <laughs> oh, you... Now pick up all your shit and get the fuck out. Don't ever come back. Don't be a Chad. Lesson here, kids. Don't be a Chad. Never be a Chad. Alright. So, I'm going to leave this off right here. That way it's split into two. And we are going to continue the rest of this on... Saturday, which is tomorrow. So, uh, 
as always, the game will be linked down below. Let me know down in the comments what you think so far. What are your theories, your thoughts, your premonitions? Don't. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. I am Zombie Kitty. Thank you and have a good night.